Welcome to the Google Education Update for July 2024. There has been a heap of updates in the Google Education space over the last few weeks and months. Um, so let's go into a few of my favorites. So first ones are inside Google Classroom. We now have Read Along. If it's not there for you, make sure that your admin has turned it on for you to make sure that you've got access. Now, what it does is it allows the amazing Read Along app to be pulled inside Google Classroom and now I can actually set a book for a student or a group or a whole class based on a reading level. So this now targets our students at the right level, allowing them to get a book that's right for them and possibly on a topic that you actually have um, going on in your classroom. The second Google Classroom update is around the YouTube questions now. We have Gemini sitting inside the YouTube questions, and so you can actually pop in the YouTube clip that you would like to go in there. And this one has suggested a couple of questions already in there for me. I click on one of those questions, and it actually has the answer options in there as well. I can edit this if I want to, otherwise I can just add it to my YouTube clip. Simple, easy, time saver. The next one around Google Classroom is the add-on. So there has been 10 new add-ons added to Google Classroom. And so we now have a whole heap more sitting there or ones that are coming very shortly. So keep an eye out for those. Remember, these need to be added individually by your Google admin to your Google uh, Classroom platform. The next exciting tool is a brand new tool inside Google called Google Vids. To go there, you just click on New inside Drive, and the Vids is right there underneath the normal tools that are there. This is a video creation tool, and you can actually record, and it actually has a teleprompter that will pop up so that it makes your recording a lot easier. will help the students, too, not to forget what they're supposed to be talking about when they're creating these amazing videos. Really cool new tool. Love it. The next one is around Google Docs. We now have e-signatures inside Google Docs. So if you have got the Education Plus, you will be able to add e-signatures in here. So this could be around a signature or initials. You could have um, the name field in there or a text field, or even like the date signed. And you just request that e-signature from different signers. And the next one is Reading Mode. So if you haven't had a play with Reading Mode yet, Reading Mode is actually inside um, our Google Chrome. So if I went to a website that had heaps of information and advertising on it, I can now click to open reading mode, which is in our three dots under more tools and reading mode is there. And I can actually get the text out of it rather than everything else makes it so that it's not so distracting for our children. And coming very soon inside this re reading mode is the ability for it to actually play and read it to you. The next one is actually inside Google Slides. This, there is actually a Google Slides recorder in here. So when I click to record, it takes me to this little recorder and I can create my Google um, Slides as a video. So no ha more having to go out and use an extension or having to use a third party tool. I can actually record my slides within the, within the slides tool, which is super amazing. And that has been our Google Education Update for July 2024. If you want to find out more, there is the Google Education EDU in 90 YouTube channel that actually has all the product releases and tutorials every month. Pop on in here. Definitely one to subscribe to. Thanks for watching.